poster is uneven. something about this uh, what I'm thinking is putting four pins on these posters and these ones here and let's get that under away So the pins through the tinsel onto my shelves. You know, I've just done the most stupidest thing ever. You probably can't see it. So what happened was I was trying to open this, right? And I had tape on it. Anyway, how are you all doing today? Because it's a new day and we're going to get to work. We're going to put some tinsel. We're going to pin them onto the shelves. Uh, we're going to pin my lights on to the poster, like I said, and I'm actually going to attempt this again uh, because I don't want them falling off and it's really annoying, it really is. Um, so let's get underway. I've just realised, guys, I don't have these laminated yet. Why? Oh, I can't do them just now because I don't have them laminated. Oh my god. So, yes, we have Christmas lights on here. Wasn't what I had in mind, but it looks cool. So, sorry about that rude interruption. Now, anyway, I'm starting an art class at tomorrow. By the way, hi, it's a new day. How are you all doing today? Tonight. <laughs> Good. Um, and my original idea was to build more shelves. And by shelves, I mean corner shelves. And then get a big wooden board. That thick, about that thick, I would say. Um, and cut out. 3D letters, so the SC would be joined and the S and the 21 would be joined together, but made out of wood, uh, painted the same way as them. Now, I don't know, and I thought of another idea today that could be my backup plan, but I still work with wood, but it's less work. Now, you understand what I mean. So, I thought of an idea is to get a wooden board that's not thick, I would say about that thick um but the same size as my poster 55 inches by length i don't know what it is by width now originally i measured um 26 and a half now that was before i added this white line apparently i kind of see before i added this pink line now i would imagine it'd be another inch I, i'm not really good at measuring so we're actually going to measure this again. Uh, so my idea is to put my poster on the wooden board. But here's the cool part. I'm going to try and... You know, I should... Um, get a recording sign on my door. Sorry guys. Anyway, as I was saying, yes. Um, I'm thinking about trying to get LED strip lights and wrapping them around... The wooden board. Wouldn't that look really cool? I mean, while I'm talking, while you guys are sitting on my shelf, you'll see the poster lit up. 
on the front and on the sides. Now that, now that sounds better in my opinion than that project idea. And it's probably a lot less work because all we just need is a wooden board. All we need to do is cut the sides that we need. I know it's not easy, but in fact, that's, I do that intentionally, by the way. I make things sound easily intentional because then it will be easy. Does that make sense? Yes? No? I would imagine you'll be saying no, but it does to me. <laughs> now, if you have a vlogger and you have a GoPro, right, and you're doing a, a project on a video, I highly recommend taking a GoPro. I'm actually going to turn it off just now because it's at 20, 24%. Well, I'm going to turn you off. Mm -hmm. Good. Good morning. How are we all doing today? Yes, this video has been quite for a, quite a few days. Now, the reason why I recommend a GoPro, first of all, as you guys know, the equipment I use, I love my chest strap that I have for my GoPro. Now, if you haven't, I'm actually not going to show you. I'm going to get you to watch one of maybe a couple of my videos i recommend watching car spotting part one and three all the way through to three one to three maybe one to four um i'll link them below so you can go and check them out um because i use the chest strap and i also use this chest strap to make the film me making this now i have decided on what project I want to do. That's right, I'm going to make a wooden board for this to wrap LED strips around the poster. Now that would be quite a task to get it up, but if it's a go today, I might come up with something else, which I haven't thought of yet, um, if we can work with wood. Oh, by the way, it's got my tinsel up. Um, I love Christmas, by the way, which is uh, why I'm, um, I'm a bit early. Yeah, I love Christmas. Um, so yeah, I will see you. You might be meeting somebody today. I don't know whether, if he'll be there, I don't know. So I've got the gym this morning. Um, so we'll go there this morning. Whoa, as my voice cracked. Um, it's quite cool this morning. Quite I'm not being now, but it looks really cool. You're probably getting bored of me. I'll see you whenever I see you. <laughs> yes, guys. Um, that project idea I was telling you about, the one where, it, about over here, it's a go. It's happening as we speak well. Obviously, um, I'll be working on it one, one day a week, so... Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be quite a task, but we are gonna get it done. And by we, I mean me and the art teacher. Or, well, he's gonna help me at some point if I need help. Now tomorrow, tomorrow. Now, if you haven't checked out last episode, if you have, you will know that I um, I'm doing my one day work experience tomorrow with Suzuki, um, which is really good. Um, it's a good start. Um, for next year, because I'm thinking about doing another course in college next year that has uh, an eight week work experience. So you get three days for eight weeks. Oh, so that means once I go to Suzuki tomorrow, next year, I can go back to them. So yeah, I'm, I'm knackered. I'm actually really tired, to be honest with you guys. So, I know these past few episodes hasn't been about me sticking the posters up. I'm really sorry, it's just um, things are going so well for the past few weeks. Um, I had to make videos about it, and we're talking about cars, basically, in my poster crop project, and I thought, cars, cars. Yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Poster Collection Part 15. I will see you in the next one.
Satisfying. <laughs>